My personal statement was important because I feel like without it, I wouldn't have got accepted into the colleges that I did. And also, I wouldn't have received the McConnell uh, Scholarship and the College Options Scholarship, as well as local scholarships that allowed me to be able to go to college. Um, and then also, it allowed me to look back on my life and see what I've, I've accomplished. And I got to learn about myself and my family. My personal statement was important because it helped me to show the admissions committee why I was unique and why I would make a great addition to their campus because of the things that I've done in my life. And it was also important to help me get the McConnell Foundation Scholarship and other local scholarships to help my family and I afford college for my twin sister and myself. I started my personal statement by brainstorming and jotting down a few things that have made me the person I am today. And then as I start to write about those things and think about them, it was a lot easier to start my essay. To start my personal statement, I came into College Options and spoke with one of the advisors about important life events that I had experienced and he helped me discuss what events had helped shape who I am and come up with a central theme for my personal statement and that made it a lot easier on me to be able to write the whole essay. After developing a rough draft of my personal statement, I had people take a look at it, such as an advisor in my ETS program at my high school, an advisor here at College Options, and I also developed connections with the person at admissions, and I had them take a look at it and hear what they had to say and what I should put in and take out or what I should talk more about, and that really helped me. Um, my resources were something that definitely help me with my personal statement. The hardest part of my personal statement was writing about myself and feeling like I was bragging about myself when really your personal statement is your opportunity to highlight events in your life to show the admissions committee why you should go to their school and why you would be a great addition. The hardest part of my personal statement was that I felt like I had a lot of things to talk about. So it was all about turning one paragraph into two sentences and writing the sentences perfect and with no mistakes. Also, the introduction and conclusion is what took me the longest because I felt that um, I wanted the person whoever was reading my essay to be intrigued and um, had their mind open and see what I have to offer within the last, uh, within my introduction and my conclusion. So those were the hardest parts.